Let's take a lap around. I'm Shane Lewis. We're in the Pontiac G8 GXP pace car. Let's go look at this racetrack. I'm going to talk you around a little bit. When you're leaving pit lane, you got to make sure you stay all the way to driver's left. Because if you drift out too far, that's where the high speed traffic come out of turn one is. So you want to stay to driver's left. Come leaving pit lane. Now we have two configurations you can run here. This weekend we're running what's called the Pro Course. The reason we run the Pro Course it gives better opportunities for the competitors for passing, as well as a great place for the spectators to watch. Now come on up off the pro course, on the brakes, coming up to what we call the keyhole. I like to kind of double apex the keel, let it come all the way out a little bit, but I want to make sure I get it back down to the curbing, because I want to unwind my hands and go to power as quick as I possibly can. It's a long back straightaway, the longest straightaway here at Mid Ohio. So it's really key to get out here as quick as you can. Now you may notice there's a starter stand up on driver's left of the uh, video screen. On occasion, they'll do actually starts on this back straightaway. The reason they do that is it has a much less congestion going into turn one and less chance for accidents. Now, all right, coming down here, big heavy brake zone, but it's really carrying downhill. So you gotta be good on the brakes, let the car carry all the way to the curbing down to the apex. You wanna carry a lot of speed down here. Now we're gonna set up for what we call madness, only let the car get back, come out about halfway, because we've gotta get it all the way to the left, up over the crest of the hill, front end's gonna get light, then the rear's gonna get light. Now we've got a lot of sections of corners here. We've gotta sacrifice all the entries a little bit, just to make sure the car is straight going over the crest of this hill. We want our hands straight as the crest, we don't want any wheel spin. The car's gonna come press down, light on the brakes, but here's a tough corner, very difficult to get. You want to be close to the apex. As you come up over the crest, you want to be feeding on the gas nice and easy, going into what we call Thunder Valley. Thunder Valley, very important to get onto because it climbs uphill a lot more than you think. You've got your three, two, one markers on the right hand side. Just enough brake to set the car, but you got to make sure when you turn in, you get really close to the left because there's all the balance of the car is going to be shooting as far as it can to the right. Now coming up to the carousel. As we set up for this, it's very important because we've got a right and left onto the front straightaway. So we're going to sacrifice a little in the beginning of the carousel because the key to this is getting a good shot onto the front straightaway. Since we left pit one, I'll kind of show you turn one here a little slower. Coming up to the bridge. Nice balance of the brakes. Get it turned in. Now you want to get right next to the curbing, but don't touch it. It'll really upset the car. Let it drift all the way to the outside. All right, let's pick it up a little bit. Right along. Pontiac Pace Car, Grand Am Race here at Mid-Ohio Sports Car Cars.